Former temps we're seeing calls for the return of those spotted lantern flies. The invasive species was first spotted in New York State back in 2020 and ever since they've only been threatening apple orchards, vineyards with the sticky substance they emit called honeydew, which exposes crops to mold and disease. Researchers with Cornell say they've been working since last fall to come up with these strategies to squash the lantern flies before they hatch this year, looking for predators, reducing their natural food sources, or even using fungi that can attack them. There's a lot of work going into kind of seeing can we can we kind of commercialize that? Can we turn that into can we take spores of that and turn it into a spray that we can then spray onto either the trees or onto the insects themselves or something that can then use that as a natural control um, rather than again having to use having to use chemicals, which we really don't want to use if we if we can avoid it. And experts add here right now these pests are a bigger concern in the Hudson Valley and Long Island areas, but it's not a question of if it is when the Finger Lakes will start to see its lanternfly population. It's suggested to check your yards, firewood and outdoor furniture for any lanternfly eggs. Besides just stomping on them, they can be killed by scraping them into a bucket of hot soapy water or simply sanitizer.